Well, hello, and welcome once again to Something Plays. I'm your good friend Bradley, and today I'm trying to figure out what's going on with my Sea Glide. I know that I need another battery, and it was saying exchange power source. And now I have a battery that's 92% charge? I don't. I, I, I don't know what happened. So I have one that has no charge now. So I guess I can recharge these batteries. I need to find a battery recharger, apparently. I've got some gold. I've got some copper. I need some more silver because I need to make wiring stuff for things that we need to build. Um, I also want to see if I can find more of those sea moth plans. The little uh, one-person submersible. Hit the timer there, baby. And I've got to be careful about water and food. That's one thing I want to apologize for the last episode. I'm very sorry, gang, that my big fat head was blocking the health, food, and water, and O2 uh, sensor. What am I trying to say? Readouts on the display. I don't know how that happened. I, I can't believe I looked at that and was like, oh, that looks fine. I mean, obviously, I don't see that when I'm playing it, but I should have noticed it on the feed. So I apologize. Now you should be able to see that. I'm looking now. Yes, you can see all of my health and all that good stuff. Um, speaking of which, I need some water. PDQ. I uh, don't have any on me. God damn it. All right, I need to find some bladderfish. Mm-hmm. Let's make some water, shall we? Then we're going to go on a trip. Where to? I don't know, but it looks like we have another radio message. We'll have to listen to that, too. Bom, 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 water. Okay, then. That should be quite enough. Uh, we'll eat all these. Oh, we only need one paper. Coot. 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 Yeah, I'll do it. I kind of... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, gang. Still sick. Um, I know these things are going to go bad. Oh, but I do have salt. I do have salt. Let's do that. Let's do that. Look, look, look. I can't do a cured peeper? Oh, you have to... It can't be cooked first. Can darn it. All right. Well, it's pointless for me to hold on to the peepers that I have that are cooked, so I'm just going to eat them up. I'm going to scarf them down. All right. So... Let's check our inventory here one more time. I have no room for anything. Fine. Excellent. Let's go. Now, we had that signal from the radio. Oh, I didn't listen to the other radio transmission. All right, here we go. Play it. The captain is gone. I have assumed command. The last thing the captain did was give me coordinates for dry land. We regroup one and a half kilometers southwest of the crash site. Stay together and good luck. This message will now hmm. repeat. Rendezvous coordinates corrupted. Transmission origin coordinates downloaded. Signal okay. Location uploaded. So this is going to give me the location of the escape pod that was giving us the rendezvous coordinates, but we don't have the rendezvous coordinates. Keen. So, we had the other coordinates for pod 17, I believe it was. Um, but we already found 17, and we already uploaded the PDA, so I don't really know... Okay, so that was 17. Let's go to 19. It's as good a direction as any, if I can find it. Where the hell is it? Uh, do I have to go to 17 first to trigger 19? These stalkers are everywhere. Maybe I have to run to 17 first. Because I'm not seeing 19 anywhere. Hmm. Maybe they're just trying to lead me on a particular path, I guess. I don't know. All right. Well, let's head towards 17. It's not that far. We'll trigger, hopefully, the next HUD update, and we'll know where we're going. And in the meantime, we can keep our eye out. Our eyeballs peeled for more silver ore, because God knows I need it. I need a bad man. Silver. Look okay. at what's this? Mobile be be vehicle, a vehicle. Uh, uh, where is my scanner? There it is. Do I have enough of these? Oh, I must have already had those. Okay. What are these things? Drooping stinger. 
<laughs> that's what they call my penis. That's, that's horrible. That would that that's a horrible nickname for for your genitals. Don't ever let anyone call your penis the drooping stinger. And there's all these stupid eggs. I don't know what they're for. Now wait a minute. Is that 17? No, oh, that's 19. And that's 17. Okay, so we don't have to go to 17. We can go to 19. We're going to go in that direction. Frame rate. Come on now, baby. Give me my hundreds. Hundreds and hundreds of frames, please. Metal salvage. I don't need any titanium right now. Whoa. What's this about? Glowy coral? Passing 100 meters. Yeah, Oxygen yeah, yeah. Efficiency decreased. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. Maybe we don't want to do that right now. <laughs> There's the reef things. I wish I knew what those were called. I, could I scan those? Am I allowed to scan those? I'm going very slowly because I don't have my sea glide going here. I want to try to scan one of these babies. Let's see what happens. We also need to go to the surface anyway for oxygen. What are you? A reef back. Come on. This is a long scan. I'm right in the anus. Right in the taint area. Indigenous life forms reef, ba reef back. Okay, I'm going to have to look at all this later. Um, oh, yeah. Breathe. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, 19, 17, 19. Excellent. Let's get up into the air long enough to actually refill our oxygen. There we go. Let's get the sea glide. Let's go. The daylight's a wasting, gang. Still up. Oh. Is that one of those scary ass? Yeah, that's I don't know what that thing is called, but it's it's weird. He's angry. Okay, we're going towards Keen's last broadcast. Still on the lookout for silver. I can't believe how many things need silver, and I can't ever find any silver. I'm not seeing any sandstone outcroppings. That's just great. So how deep is this thing, man? Still 474 meters away. Ooh, this is this is getting a little a little scary. I'm pretty far down too already. Let me be more towards the surface here because I'm gonna have to go up for air. We'll get over it and then we'll pounce down upon it. That's the plan. Okay. Okay. Breathe, boy. Breathe. Here we go. Reef backs. Do they have eyeballs? I don't see any eyeballs. Hello. Are those genitals? No. Fins of some sort. Oh, look. Intakes. Air intakes. But they're... Actually, that's like the opposite of... <coughs> I'm sorry. The coughing of an octopus, the jets would be going out the ass end so they could shoot themselves through the water. Um, okay, here we go. <coughs> oh, sick of this cop. Second Officer Keens. Oh wow, this is really deep. Oh, there's a bunch of shit here that I'm not going to have time to grab. Oh, oh my. Oh my god, this isn't a good place to be. This is a horrible place to be. I'm at 300 meters. What am I doing here? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh. get in there, get in there. Oh, no, 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 no. Get me my stupid scanner, you son of a bitch. It skips things. Open the data box. What is it? Ultra high capacity tank. Okay, 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 okay. Can I get in this thing? How do I get in this thing? Through here, through here. Go down, down you fool, you're gonna die. You, get, you need the PDA. Get it, get the PDA. Oh, I'm so dead, I'm so dead. I'm so dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. There's no way I survived this. I'm dead. Ah! 
Lost some belongings, did I? What did I lose? If they had taken away my one silver ore, I would have been quite perturbed. I still have my sea glide, blah, 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 blah. I wonder if I load. I can't load, can I? They don't give you a load option. Okay. And I don't think I have the new entry. Do I have the new entry for the ultra high capacity tank? Uh... I guess there's a train coming. So I didn't. Oh, look at this. Conserves oxygen when diving deeper, absorbs and recycles. Oh, I need that. And the radiation suit. Okay. So again, I need silver for a wiring kit here. I have, I have one silver ore. I can, I think it's worth it to get the high capacity tank. So all I need is two glass and four titanium which I should have plenty of. I don't need you out right now. Get my knife. Uh, two glass? What made, What gave me glass? Quartz? Am I out of quartz? I have one quartz. Okay, so that'll give me my glass. Um, and then titanium. I have more titanium, right? In my locker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh There's another radio message. God, chatty people. This is Sunbeam. You know Aurora. We're from a little <coughs> transgov on the far side of Andromeda, <coughs> and we have a saying there. There's no bad without the good, no good without the bad. Sounds like you tasted a bunch of the former. But that only means you're overdue a whole lot of the latter. Might just be we're in. All right, we're Sunbeam. For somewhere to park. We'll be in touch when we find it. Sunbeam out. When you retire as a captain, you get a job writing stupid motivational posters with cats trying to climb walls that say, hang in there and stuff on them. Things like that. Idiot. Um, I'm sorry. That was harsh. The captain is... I, it's a stressful situation. You know? It's very stressful. What am I? What am I building? I was going to build something. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, I need... Uh, I need more glass. So I need to take my quartz. Wait a minute. I need two quartz. Con starn everything. I thought I had... I thought I had more quartz. I must have lost some of the quartz when I died. Yeah, salt deposit. Oh, that's the quartz. For freaking out loud. Okay, I have the quartz. I'm sick. Okay, so we're making quartz. I mean, we're making glass out of quartz. And then I think I have to take off my thingy. Uh, you go off there. Okay, and now I think... Stop it. I think that I can make my high... No, what am I missing? I've got my standard O2 tank. What? Or is this already the high capacity one? Am I already wearing the high capacity? Oh my god. Let's just forget that happened. I thought they said I got a new blueprint. Was there a super high capacity tank? Okay. A rebreather. Oh, a compass. Copper wire. Uh, everything needs a wiring kit! Everything needs silver. Everything good needs silver. Computer chip. That needs silver. Doesn't it? No. <laughs> okay. But uh, the wiring kit, that needs two silver ore. And I need... So that's one, two, three, four silver ore for these two things. Ugh, for freaking out loud. Okay. I want to go down to that wreck. We don't have a lot of oxygen with which to do that, but we could make this floating air pump thing. And then we could make some pipes. So this is only titanium. So maybe this isn't a big deal. I've got quite a bit of titanium. I actually have more in my locker. Are any of those stalkers out here? This is what we're gonna do. 
I want to see what's in that wreck. I bet there are cool things for us to scan. Don't. Ah, oh, he's here. He's here. Oh, he bit me. He bit me right in the butt. Jesus Christ, man. Why do you do that? I'm not edible. Not at all. Can I use this? No. Okay. <coughs> We're going to get past it. Deployables. Did I say deplorables or deployables? Uh, where is the air thing? Shouldn't that be... Oh, air bladder. No, that's not it. Ah, floating air pump. Pumps air into pipes. Acts as starting point, point for a pipe chain. So then we need to make pipes times five. So how much is it going to take to get down there is what I'm wondering. So I don't want to waste a ton of titanium. Let's just take a look here. This is our goal, to go down to that wreck. We're going down to 300 meters, man. That's crazy. All right, so we have... Oh, my God. The inventory is stacked full of crap at the moment. I better not... Actually, I guess I don't need my first aid kit. I'll use some water. Um, okay, so we're going to plan our trip. We're going to put everything away that we can. We are going to bring our air pump and our pipes. And we are going to try to see if there's anything cool to scan in that wreck. We are also going to be on the lookout for silver. Because God knows we need it. Uh, glass, I don't need that. Uh, salt deposits. Okay, I'm gonna have to put some of this in my other little lockers. Where are those guys? Okay. Oh, I grabbed a PDA, didn't I? And I didn't listen to it? Uh, b b voice log. Where's the data downloads? Aurora survivors. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're reading the see if all the items just as before so you are just grab safe to attempt to reach the designated writing for us address. Okay. Huh. Okay. So he's not there. He left. So he might be at the rendezvous point. I shouldn't be doing this when I'm underwater. Um anyway. Oh, I have tons of quartz. Okay, so we'll put the glass in there. Put the salt deposit in there. That seems like a quartzy kind of place to put it. Uh, gold as well. Sure, why not? Leave me alone. Uh, where's my other thing? There it is. I keep losing my place. Here we are going to place our titanium and our lead. And our fiber mesh. Why not? Look, he's got metal! <laughs> and our one silver ore so we don't lose it later. That's a good idea. Okay. I wonder if... No, that's not a good idea. All right, let's get the hell out. Oh, no, no, no. I need food. I need food. Damn it. Okay. We're going to get some food, then we're going to go on our trip. <coughs> hey, I just scanned a grab trap. Okay, I don't know what that is, but that's cool. Um, beacon fragment. Okay, I need more of that. I can make beacons myself, it looks like. Is this another one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scan it! So we're kind of on their way, <coughs> on our way to Life Pod 19 again. Even though we already got the PDA info, info I still want to try to <coughs> salvage the wreck. <sighs> um, <coughs> God damn it. Sorry, it's hard to talk when you've got a cough and a sore throat. I don't think there's anything else I can scan here. So I really want to look at wrecks and things. I want to find more info on that sea moth. Um, <clears throat> one thing I did do... Oh, no! Ugh, you son of a bitch. That'll give me some more cave sulfur, though. Creepy dudes. Um, one thing I do want to do... Can't remember what I was going to say. Do I need more quartz? I'll get some more quartz. Uh, uh, something about something. Scanning things. Oh, the sea moth? 30 seconds of oxygen. I wanted to make sure I get that little submersible submarine because I think that can go deeper than I can anyway. 
maybe. I don't know how that works exactly, but we'll see. We'll figure it out. Okay, so there's 19. We're scanning shit. We're looking for stuff. Might as well get my sea glide going. When I try to use my mouse wheel for this stuff, it skips things. Oh, look, 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 look. Is this a rocky outcropping? It's not. Damn it, I thought that was a sandstone outcropping. Still looking for silver. Still need silver. Very badly. Uh, yeah. Grab the salvage. We might not have enough daylight to do this, actually. This might have been a bad idea. What's this? Time capsule? The builder tool is Ooh. designed to construct habitats capable of withstanding I got a environmental conditions. I got a habitat builder tool? What? <coughs> that was one of the things I wanted to make. I'm going to the surface. Hold on, everybody. Tab it. Uh, metal salvage. Repair tool. Scanner. Did they give me a tool? I, they did! Fabricates habitat compartments and appliances from raw materials. Oh, that's so awesome. Okay, cool. So we'll be, we might be able to do some base building later on. That is awesome. Okay. Uh, we're still going towards... 19, right this way. It's going to be night soon, isn't it? We want to get right over this, and we're going to try to deploy our... Our... our uh, oh, I don't like that guy. Our air source and our pipes. I don't know if it's going to be enough to actually reach all the way down there, but this is a fun experiment. We're going to Jacques Cousteau it. How much further is this place? Oh, I only have 20... I only have 25% power left on my Sea Glide, too, by the way. Which kind of sucks. I need a battery charger. I don't know how to make that. There's so many things I don't know. I don't know what I don't know. You know what? I'm okay with that. Uh-oh. Go up, go up, go up. Oh, and we have this other beacon now, too. Aurora Rendezvous Point. Dry land. There is apparently dry land somewhere. That's amazing. I better go up. Hey, it's one of those big reef things. How you doing, buddy? Reef it back? I want my reef it back, reef it back, reef it back. Um, <coughs> I've just constant need to cough. I know it's annoying to listen to. It looks like I have a new radio transmission as well. So, there is the signal. We're going to go... Okay, stop doing that. I just want to go... I want to stay up towards the surface. I don't want to fly right down to this thing. So it should be almost beneath me. <coughs> Not quite. Not quite. Can start... What is this? Is this a floating island? That's crazy. Okay, let's get our oxygen. Let's deploy our air source. Our oxygen source. Look at this. Holy crap. <coughs> How far away am I from 1159? Oh my god, gang. There's dry land. I didn't know there was any dry land here. Okay, well, obviously we're going there at some point. Deploy. Uh... Deploy. Okay. Uh, put this in a quick slot. Does that work? Pick up floating air pump. How do I... Oh, okay. How far does this go? Not very far. Oh my god. This isn't going to do anything for me. This was a mistake. I'm going to get down like 30 meters. It's ridiculous. I would need a hundred of these things. Alright. We're going to see what happens. Maybe 
backing my ass right into some toothy maw, too, I'm sure. Ugh. I don't understand exactly how this works. And they don't go straight down, either. Biodiversity in this region is unusually low. Cause unknown. Okay, well... Am I getting oxygen? Okay, I'm getting oxygen now. So all I am, I'm 60 meters down. And it's dark. <laughs> God damn it. <coughs> <coughs> I should have made more pipes, but I didn't want to waste all that titanium. Um, I'm going to wait till morning because I don't want to go down there in the pitch black because it freaks me out, man. Uh, yeah, not going to do that. We're going to go up to the top and I'm going to hang out by my little floaty oxygen thingy and then once it's light we will dive down and that's probably how we'll end the episode we will salvage what we can from that wreck all right the sun is finally starting to rise i just realized something not great i have four percent power left in my sea glide and i'm going to need that to get back up to the surface when i am drowning because i'm going to be running all the way down to 300 meters so this is not going to go well, probably. So I'm not going to use my sea glide on the way down. I'm going to pause here by this pipe, refill my oxygen. Oh, boy. This isn't going to go well. Where is that thing at? It's right there. Okay. Here we go! I've got 130 seconds of oxygen. Actually, no, I have less because my efficiency decreases the further I go. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I can't see anything because I don't have a light. Because my sea glide is dead. Uh, I need to find what I can find, man. Is there anything of value down here? What is this? Abandoned PDA. Officer Keen's voice log. Integrating new PDA data. I grab that. Okay, I have to risk my my thingy. Is there anything else to salvage? Is that it? Just the PDA? Oh, I don't have enough time. I don't have enough time. There wasn't anything else in here, was there? No. I gotta go. I gotta go. 30 seconds. I'm gonna die. Gotta go. Come on, Sea Glide! It's almost dead. Oxygen. It's almost dead. It's dead. Shit. Where's my pipe? Where's my pipe? Where's my pipe? I'm going to fucking die again. Oh, my God. Lost some stuff. Not sure what exactly. I had a lot more than this. Oh, my habitat builder is gone! Oh, I was so happy to have the habitat builder, and now it's gone. Why didn't I save the game before I went on that little journey? Okay. So obviously I don't have the resources or the skills or the items necessary to go down to 300 meters. I ran out of batteries, didn't have enough oxygen, couldn't swim far enough, fast enough, and now I've lost a bunch of schniz, and I'm not happy about that. In the next episode, I'm going to try to improve these situations so I no longer have these kinds of setbacks. It's ridiculous. I've died twice. This game was supposed to be a stress-free way for me to chill out <coughs> while sick. <coughs> <coughs> that is not what's been going on. This game is stressing me out quite a bit. I'm enjoying every minute of it, but I'm stressed beyond belief. You're constantly worried about 
your health, about your water intake, about your food, about your air. You're always on this knife's edge of survival. And that's awesome, but oh my god. Screw off! I was just talking about the knife's edge of survival. Go lick a dick. Get out of here. The only place that's safe is in here. Until some giant leviathan comes with a mouth big enough to swallow this thing whole. Let's listen to the radio, shall we? This is Life Pod 6. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Okay, so I need the radiation Request suit. Immediate assistance. Six out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. Okay. So we've got some places to go. We've got the dry land rendezvous point. Man, I lost so much shit. And then we've got life pod six, but we need to have lead to make a radiation suit. We'll have to do that later. But until next time, until we meet again, I'm going to go up here and I'm going to stare out into the ocean and think about how I have failed repeatedly. But until next time, tell me to get up and you're going to be of these plays. I'll see you later.